So yesterday I brought you some news that DJI have launched app version 1.4.4 for iOS. Now I'm pleased to tell you, hopefully straight on the ball with this one, it seems that this morning DJI have now launched app version 1.4.4 for Android. Okay. Now what I'm going to do on this video is just very quickly show you how to install it if you haven't got the prompt through the app already. Sometimes DJI do take a little bit longer to update through the app, but if you want to get it sooner and get it straight away, you can do so using this method. So I'm going to show you that now. Right, so all you need to do is open up a web browser on your mobile device, and then what we need to do is we're going to type in DJI, and that should give us a nice suggestion at the top to the DJI Flight Download Center. Let's click OK. Now, as we open up the download center, you will see iOS still shows 1.4.2 and Android still shows 1.4.2 also. However, if we click the button where it says download Android APK, do you want to download this file again? Because I've already downloaded it before I did this video. Um, so we'll click download. So there we go. Now that has downloaded, we're going to click the open. At this point, you might get a security prompt, but uh, yeah, just go ahead and click OK. It's perfectly safe. Do you want to install an update to this existing application? Your existing data will not be lost. Let's go ahead and click Install. And then all we need to do is click the Open button, and then it should do some unpacking. Now the DJI Fly app is open, so all we need to do is just to check that version. We will click Profile, and then we will click Settings. And then on this bottom left corner, as you can see, DJI Fly version 1.4.4 build 1072. Nicely installed, nice and simple. So if you are an Android user, that is how you upgrade to the latest app version from DJI, the version 1.4.4 matching the iOS release, which was yesterday. So for some time now, DJI Fly app has not been on the Google Play Store and you have to go get it manually using this method. If you have a phone such as Huawei, um, they do have their own app store, so you're likely going to get this update automatically and that's absolutely fine. If you do also have uh, the DJI Fly app installed, at some point, point it will pop up to tell you that there is a latest version and to update but if you can't wait for that this is the method to do it nice and quickly and simply now what i will do is at some point i will grab one of my drones and i will go for a little flight just to test everything out i cannot see any in anything in the release notes to say what's new just the usual uh, bugs and fixes and as for the ios update yesterday nobody's reported any new features but i'll take a look at it so anyway thank you very much for watching Please subscribe if you haven't already and give this video a thumbs up if you have found it useful. See you again soon.